सी आई टी एन सी ई आर टी प्रेजेंट्स ऑडियो बुक ऑफ मैथमेटिक्स फॉर क्लास एट दिस इज चैप्टर टेन विजुअलाइजिंग सॉलिड शेप्स फ्रॉम पेज नंबर वन फिफ्टी थ्री टू पेज नंबर वन सिक्सटी एट लेट्स लिसन टू चैप्टर टेन विजुअलाइजिंग सॉलिड शेप्स पेज नंबर वन फिफ्टी थ्री टेन पॉइंट वन इंट्रोडक्शन इन क्लास सेवन यू हैव लर्न अबाउट प्लेन शेप्स एंड सॉलिड शेप्स प्लेन शेप्स हैव टू मेजरमेंट्स लाइक लेंथ एंड ब्रेथ एंड देर फोर दे आर कॉल्ड टू डिमेंशनल शेप्स वेयर एज अ सॉलिड ऑब्जेक्ट हैज थ्री मेजरमेंट्स लाइक लेंथ ब्रेथ हाइट और डेप्थ हेंस they are called three dimensional shapes also a solid object occupies some space two dimensional and three dimensional figures can be briefly named as 2d and 3d figures you may recall that triangle rectangle circle etc are 2d figures while cubes cylinders cones spheres etc are three dimensional figures do this match the following first one is done for you here we have three columns in the first column we have the shape in the second column we have type of shape in the third column we have name of the shape column 1 the first shape has four sides and all the sides are equal the second shape looks like a cap worn on a birthday the third shape looks like a drum the fourth shape has three sides the fifth shape looks like a dice the sixth shape looks like sun the seventh shape looks like a brick The last shape looks like a bowl with a semicircle over it. Column two, three-dimensional, two-dimensional, three-dimensional, two-dimensional, three-dimensional, three-dimensional, two-dimensional, three-dimensional. Column three, sphere, cylinder, square, circle, cuboid, cube, cone, triangle. One matching. has been done for you the first shape is column 1 has been matched with two dimensional in column 2 and with square in column 3 page number 154 note that all the above shapes are single however in our practical life many times we come across combinations of different shapes for example observe the following objects a tent a cone surmounted on a cylinder a tin a cylindrical shell softy ice cream a cone surmounted by a hemisphere a photo frame a rectangular path a bowl a hemispherical shell tomb on a pillar cylinder surmounted by a hemisphere do this match the following pictures or objects with their shapes picture or object shape one an agricultural field two a groove three a toy four a circular park five a cross path we have here pictures of all these things on the other side we have the shape two rectangular cross paths inside a rectangular park a circular path around a circular ground a triangular field adjoining a square field a cone taken out of a cylinder a hemisphere surmounted on a cone 10.2 views of 3d shapes you have learned that a three dimensional object can look differently from different positions so they can be drawn 
from different perspectives. For example, a given hut can have the following views. Here we have a hut. There is front of the hut and side of the hut along with top of the hut. We can first observe the front view where we can observe the door. Then we can observe the side view where we can observe the window. Then we have the top view where we can observe the chimney. Similarly, a glass can have the following views. A glass. Then we have the side view of the glass. Then we have an image of the top view of the glass. Why is the top view of the glass a pair of concentric circles? Will the side view appear different if taken from some other direction? Think about this. Now look at the different views of a brick. Page number 156. Here we have a brick. The top, front and side of the brick has been marked. Then we can observe the front view of the brick, the side view of the brick and the top view of the brick which has one rectangle within the other. We can also get different views of figures made by joining cubes. For example, here we have a solid made of three cubes. The side, front and top has been marked. The side view has two squares. The front view has three squares, one in first column, two in second column. The top view has two squares horizontally next to each other. Then we have solid made of four cubes. There is top view, front view and side view. Top view has two squares in first column and two squares in second column. The top square of the first column and the last square of the second column are joined together. Front view has two squares next to each other horizontally. Side view has three squares next to each other horizontally. Then we have a solid made of four cubes. There is front, top and side marked. Side has two squares horizontally next to each other. Front view has three squares horizontally next to each other. Top view has three squares with one square at the top of the middle square. Do this. Observe different things around you from different positions. Discuss with your friends their various views. Page number 157 1. For each of the given solid, the two views are given. Match for each solid the corresponding top and front views. The first one is done for you. In the first column, we have object. In the second column, we have side view. In the third column, we have top view. Column 1 A. A bottle B. A weight C. A flask D. Cup and saucer E. Container Column 2 Here, we have an image that has a rectangle in the center and two square-like shapes on the side. 2. Here, we have an image where there is a rectangle within a rectangle and a cap at the top. 3. Here, we have an image of an object that resembles something we use for having soft drinks. 4. Here, we have a shape which has a rectangle and a hemisphere at the top. 5. Here, we have a shape which resembles something we require for drinking tea. Top view 1. Here, we have a small circle within a rectangle. 2. Here, we have a shape that resembles 
half banana. Three. Here we have a circle within a circle within a circle. Four. Here we have a circle within a circle. Five. Here we have a hexagon within a hexagon, and five kg is written on it. Page number one fifty eight. Two. For each of the given solid, the three views are given. Identify for each solid the corresponding top, front, and side views. A. Here we have an almira. The side, front, and top view has been marked. One. In this view, we have a mirror and a handle. Two. In this view, we can observe a large rectangle. Three. In this view, we can observe a small rectangle. B. A matchbox. Here, the front, side, and top view has been marked. One, in this view, we can observe the place used to light the matchstick. Two, here we can observe the place that is required to pull out the matchsticks. Three, here we can observe the print of a fish, which is Most probably, the branding of the matchstick. C. Here we have a television. The top, front, and side view has been marked. In the first view, we can observe the screen and a few buttons. In the second view, we can observe the back side of the television. In the third view, we can observe. A brick-like object kept on a square-shaped object. D. A car. The top, front, and side view has been marked. In the first view, we can observe the headlights of the car. In the second view, we can observe the door and the door handles. In the third view, we can observe the roof. Page number one fifty-nine. Three. For each given solid, identify the top view, front view, and side view. A. In this image, we have three blocks placed together. The top, side, and front view has been marked. One. One square in first column. Two squares on top of each other in second column. Two. Two squares kept horizontally next to each other. Three, two squares kept horizontally next to each other. B, here we have four cubes kept next to each other. The top, side, front view has been marked. One, two squares kept horizontally next to each other. Two, three squares kept horizontally next to each other. Three. Two squares in first column, one square each in top row of column two and column three. C. Here we have a shape that resembles a stair kept sideways. The top, side, and front view has been marked. One, two squares kept horizontally next to each other. Two, three squares kept horizontally next to each other. Three. Three squares in the first column, one square in the middle of the second column. D. Again, something has been made with the help of four cubes. The top, side, front view has been marked. One, two squares, one on top of each other. Two, one square in first column, one square in second column, two squares in the third column. Three. Three squares kept next to each other horizontally. E. Here we have another shape made with the help of four cubes. The top, side, front view has been marked. One, one square in first column, two squares in second column. Two, two squares in first column, one square 
at the top of second column. 3. One square in first column, two squares in second column. Page number 160. Draw the front view, side view and top view of the given objects. A. A military tent. Here, in the front view, we have two triangles. The side view has a rectangle which has been colored grey. The topmost side of the rectangle has been marked top. B. A table. Here, the place where we keep the books is marked as top. Then, we have the side of the table. Also, we can observe the front of the table where, presumably, there is a draw. C. A nut. Here, we have a nut. The front and the side view has been marked. There is a hexagon at the top which represents the top view. D. A hexagonal block. In the front, we have a hexagon. The top is represented with the help of a rectangle. The side is also represented with the help of a rectangle. E. A dice. Number 2 represents top. Number 1 represents side. Number 3 represents front. F. A solid. Here, we have a solid made with the help of three blocks. In the front view, we have two squares. In the side view, we have one square. At the top view, we also have one square. You were just listening to the audiobook Mathematics for Class 8. Program Coordinator Dr. Rajesh Kumar Nimesh Narrator Akash Ahuja Technical Coordinator Batilang Lingdo Sound Recordist Shanu Muksim Assistance in Production Ruchi Sharma Directed and Produced by Vimlesh Chaudhary And this program is presented to you by CIET NCERT New Delhi, India